how to make meaningful connections with your friends. There are some visits that I like, like to call doggy bag visits. Just like this song from Meat Lab, can you give me something I can take home? I enjoy these kind of misses, visits more than your people gossip magazine type of visits. You know those where you only end up discussing the latest of Grey's Anatomy drama or keeping up with the Kardashians. I think that the order to love your neighbor is one of the best blessings that we have as believers. Friends, co-believers, co-sisters or co-princesses all have solutions to the problems that we are facing. May we learn how to capitalize on this blessing. A good friend is cheaper than therapy. This is what I mean with doggy bag visits, where your friends give you something you can take home. I have been making these videos for the past two years, but I only made them in my mother tongue, Afrikaans, where my one friend suggested that I start making videos in English too. Initially, I also enjoy this quote, are you making excuses or are you waiting for someone to give you permission? This is, according to me, the best example of a victim mentality where we base our light and how bright we allow ourselves to shine based on other people's reactions on our actions. I made a video on this topic too. So based on my friend's suggestion to start making videos in English, I was ex as excited as a three-year-old in a pink candy store about the new branch of my ministry. <clears throat> so this is my first prayer and wish for you. May you, the recipient of your friend's wisdom, <clears throat> where they see, may you be the recipient of your friend's wisdom, where they see the areas you can grow and develop even more. Secondly, may God grant you the wisdom to make suggestions in your loved one's lives in order for them to sparkle even more. My second story of doggy bag visits was where I was repeating a life lesson. The life lesson was based on relationship advice that I needed. I asked my friend who has already successfully overcome this issue in a relationship. She gave me very valuable advice. Not only the RT40 abstract type of advice. No, she gave me a battle plan with concrete steps on how to be victorious. We are more than conquerors through Christ. I believe it is with doggy bag visits that we are actually able to reach this level of blessings. My wish, prayer and blessing for you all. May you also be vulnerable enough to ask for advice. Secondly, when somebody approaches you and you are the blessed soul, when they need advice from you, may God grant you the wisdom in articulating the advice they need. Read to me a page from your soul each night. This is also one of my favorite quotes of all time. May we have the boldness to share our hearts with the ones we share our time with. I recently spent some time with a friend where he showed me his box of memorabilia. It was as if I was in Alice in Wonderland peeking into his heart, seeing the things he values in life most. It was priceless. May we have the courage, the bravura, to show each other our hearts and the things we keep close. May all our visits be doggy bag visits, where, we, where the time we invest it in, into the other person really enriches our souls. The end.